I don't know why it's taken so long. His daughter was murdered here 21 years ago, but her killer is still on death row. Teresa Rodriguez, you may remember the case, was shot in the head in her own driveway by a hired hitman, Rolando Ruiz. Now, News 4's Lauren Lee spoke to her father today. What's he have to say? Eddie Sanchez is frustrated that after all these years, her killer is still alive, still trying to appeal his sentence. It takes so long to to execute somebody. This guy admitted it. He was sentenced. And 21 years later, he's still there? Eddie Sanchez has just one question. What's wrong with the system? His daughter, Teresa Rodriguez, was murdered in 1992 at 29 years old. Her husband, Michael, and her brother-in-law hired Rolando Ruiz to kill her for $2,000. It's still hard. Uh, you never get over it. Uh, all my daughters, my son, my wife. I'm sure when we're alone, that's all we think about is truth. Ruiz was granted a last-minute stay of execution back in July 2007, right before he was supposed to be put to death. And last week, an appellate court upheld his conviction and death sentence. My ex-son-in-law was executed not for Teresa, but he was one of the kindly seven. Teresa's husband, Michael Rodriguez, escaped from prison in 2000 while serving a life sentence for hiring Ruiz. Michael was one of the Texas Seven, and while they were on the run, the group killed Irving police officer Aubrey Hawkins. Michael was executed in 2008, but Ruiz is still alive. There's never closure, even when he's, when he's executed, there's no closure. We'll never see Teresa again. Ruiz can make one final appeal to the Supreme Court to try to escape death. Sanchez says he will not be there to watch his execution. Lauren Lee, News 4, San Antonio.